Hello everybody, Batman here, with another blog. So we finally moved into a new place. And boys have been at, like just hell. I mean like, we've been on the road for at least I think, six or fourteen hours, it's just ridiculous. I mean just actually. Ugh. So yeah, I'm really tired. I got some, maybe at least like five hours of sleep. It's not bad still, but of course, I have to make these blogs for you guys. And so, uh, yeah. Uh, so, first off, guys, uh, I just want to say, uh, I hope you like the new scenery and stuff. Uh, we're still kind of waiting for my um, lamp to get moved in here. Uh, like, it's, it's taking forever, because... I'm not sure, because... I'm not sure why it's taking forever, which is ridiculous. I think it's because um, we're having problems trying to get back from the... The people who took it away from us. Well, I think that's the reason why, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure where it went. But, yeah. We're still figuring it out, so, yeah. Yeah. Anyways, so to, for these new blogs here for today, I'm gonna have some different stuff. I'm now changing. Now, like I did in the previous vlog before at the old place, ugh, I did tell you about some fascinating stories. Well, the stories will stay the same. Hey, we'll, you'll still have them, but you're also gonna have some, some other stuff. They're gonna be known as as emails. There's no clever names. Like there really is no clever names we have for emails. Cause come on, Batmail sounds stupid. You're not gonna admit that. That's yeah, right. He says Batmail is stupid, but you who made Batmop a thing. Oh, excuse me. Was I talking to you, Spider Man? No. Jeez. Uh, anyway, so yeah, Hulk and Spider Man are still living with me. I'm, I'm not sure where her Hulk is. And says, buddy, where's Hulk right now? I think he went to uh, Special LA. Oh, Jim Peek said we need to get uh, Diamond. He's been eating you know, a lot of that food lately. Yeah, that's gonna be hard to get the Hulk on a diet here. We are talking about the Hulk, right? <sighs> I'm doing a vlog right now, Spidey. Anyways, so yeah, you're, we're gonna be having some emails. Um, so yeah, anyways, we're also gonna have some bat advice. Bat advice, what bat basically is. Did I just say bat basically? Oh, jeez, like, why am I adding bat to everything now? This is ridiculous. Anyways, like I said, bat advice. Well, bad advice is basically it's something I do when I give people advice. So yeah, I talk about some interesting stories that um, kind of well, uh, how do I explain this? Um, bad advice like I, Jesus, uh, this is ridiculous. Basically, I'll tell you guys sometimes stories about failures I did during missions. I'll well, give you guys good advice about how you can be a superhero, like like how to act cool and stuff, or what to wear, and I don't know, something like that. I'm just like thinking these off the top of my head. So yeah, so I hope you guys will enjoy. I enjoy these. But yeah, so right now we don't have any emails because oh, I just told you about how the emails. So we're not gonna have any emails. So first of all, let me get to the story. Now this story takes place back on the when we were still driving. And I couldn't tell you about this, guys. Well, because um, we crashed. If you remember in the last blog? It was kind of ridiculous. And I wonder whose fault that was. And I am looking at you, Spider-Man. At you. Oh, okay, not my fault. It is your fault. You floored it. Anyways. So, here's the interesting story. After we got the car fixed and the guy didn't try to kill us, well, it wouldn't be possible because, like, I'm Batman, he's Spider-Man, we have a Hulk, so, yeah. Anyways, after we were, were driving, we were having gone on uh, another highway. Uh, no, it wasn't, wasn't a highway. It was actually a really long traffic jam again. We got a lot of those. During the traffic jam, you know, we could just start, start we were actually parked next to this one car and the guy actually he rolled down his window and started and, and like yelling at us, asking and like, oh my god, oh my god, are you Batman? Are you Spider-Man? Are you Hulk? And he was basically a big fanboy and I'm going like, oh god, the worst place to meet a fanboy on the road. So, yeah, because it's really horrible and you'll see in a sec. So basically, he was going I mean, like, "Oh my God, you guys are my favorite superheroes." Well, next to the other heroes that are not here, which in his case he said were Daredevil, Green Lantern, Captain America, Superman. Of course, they're not here, which is actually kind of ironic. He didn't notice Daredevil was actually parked behind us. I found him kind of funny, but still. Anyway, see, got us a signed autographs for him, and we thought we were done. With the autographs? You think that's gonna be the one thing? No, 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 no. He kept talking to us. Entire time we were parked, even points when we were driving, 
He said I was still talking to us. Like, I'm like, what the hell, man? Stop. I mean, like, just stop. It's just ridiculous. So anyways, you know, next thing he did was actually show us fan art that he made. And it looked ridiculous. Because he literally made a fan art of me ice skating. And we were like, what? Uh, he made a fan art of Hulk being a traffic guard. And it really looked really kind of ridiculous. And Spider-Man, the gym coach, it looked really horrible. I'm going like, what the heck are these things? The drawing, his drawing is not bad, but the what he drew is weird. And so, yeah. Then he showed us this remixed version of my 1960s Batman song. And it was weird. Just uh, it's absolutely weird. Like, just the remix. I've heard remixes before, but that's, that's just weird. Like, I still don't know what... I was listening to like of course the na 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 thing was still the same, but everything else was just too weird to even explain. Just, like just it was just he was like saying something like hey, Batman got his belt, he's gonna do stuff with it, and like just I'm like what kind of lie is that? It's like stupid. So yeah, it was really odd. And you think we were dumb? You think we got rid of him? But no, he kept on going. Next thing he showed us some comic books he had. In the bus. Do you think that's gonna be normal? He's gonna be happy. I think some of our comic books, you know, might he might have some, like maybe the uh, it's a Batman comic from the fifties or a Spider-Man comic from the seventies or a Hulk comic from the eighties. I don't know. Oh, the eighties, like just yeah. But no, he actually had his own fan-made comics. Good God! I mean, just ridiculous they were. I mean, here's one thing: so the fan-made Spider-Man comic he made was literally of him at, at Comic Con. It was like really stupid. So, yeah, I'm, I'm not I'm not getting this. Uh, it was actually weird. Spider Man at Comic Con was so weird. He made like, the Spider Man go up on one of the panels and then he started rocking out, singing a song. His hits Spider Man theme song going like, like Spider Man, Spider Man, Spider Man. <coughs> sorry, voices, sorry. It was like weird. I'm not sure what he was, was doing. I think mean, uh, Hulk's comic was also really weird. It was a story about him. Being stuck at the bank for a while, I'm not sure where he's getting all these ideas. They're just really odd. And mine, it's so weird. It's literally a comic about me, Batman Beyond, and the Arkham City Batman. Oh, trying to the, the, get our right costumes. The story was basically where we get our the dry cleaners mixed up our costumes. So, so I got the Arkham City costume. The Arkham City Batman got. The Batman Beyond costume, and Batman Beyond got my costume. It was so stupid. Like, out of nowhere, he literally just threw in Michael Jackson in that comic. Like, why the heck are you throwing Michael Jackson in that comic? Like, that makes no sense. I mean, come on. We finally got rid of him. We started moving. And guess what? He can't, he just kept following us. Like, I'm more like, what? Why are you you're still following us? And then he actually, he somehow put our, our his con. I had like his phone number in our phone. He like hacked our phones, and then I'm going like, okay, that's it. And like, and the, so we called the cops, and then the cops did nothing. So we got Hulk to get out of the car, and he's really s tried smashing his car up and down, smashing his car, and that's when the cops showed up, and we got sued again. Ugh. I think this. I think on the entire time we were driving, I had the. It cost me about $25,000 for a bunch of crap, like food, paying people, um, new clothes, paying people, getting sued up our asses. Let's just say we got lost sued many times. Yeah. Anyways, now for this bad advice. So today's bad advice is something that happened to me, let's say about like, I'm going to say approximately about maybe seven weeks ago. So somewhere remember during when I was still in the old apartment. So basically, before before that big catastrophe happened in the old apartment, I was out fighting crime. I was fighting Mr. Penguin here, and Penguin had this new weapon, see, called the Penguin Spray. And what the spray does is like a penguin's, like, he used the pheromone, the penguin, which made no sense, I didn't even know penguins had pheromones. And when he sprays it on people, they somehow go under his control, and it made no sense. I think he was taking pointers from, like, I don't know, maybe the Purple Man? Is that, what that, is that what that Marvel villain's called? Who, the Purple Man? Yeah, the Purple Man. I don't, I don't know. He's not, not one of my villains. I think he's one of Daredevil's villains. Okay, whatever. Anyways, so I was fighting him, and um, the weirdest thing happens. So, um, basically, um, uh, I'm about to pull out a batarang, 
and um, I realized I don't have my belt on me, and it was kind of bad because I need my batarang, my cuffs, and my gas grenades, and I was thinking I can probably do this for him, <coughs> for him without my belts, because I also have like my shock gloves and stuff. But there's a problem because during that time my my pants, my belt was actually holding my pants, so so without my belt, my pants kind of fell down. So I know you think. It's, isn't all my the suit kind of all connected? Well, not really. The my the pants aren't right now, so they fell down right in the middle of the fight, and it kind of gave me the advantage because while they were cracking up, like dying of laughter, I got to okay, beat them up. But then someone now actually um recorded that video of me with beating them up with my my pants down, and it was recorded on the put it on the internet. And what's embarrassing about it is that my Underwear actually has pictures of the uh, 1960s Batman logo from the TV show. It was just really embarrassing. So yeah, I think we're in the pro we're in the process right now, trying to get it off the internet so my fame doesn't go down. So how are we doing on that Spidey right now? Uh, pretty good so far. We almost have it down. How much percent is uh, out? Uh, we have 88 <laughs> percent. So it should be almost out. I mean, I mean, da done. Well, good. I don't want it on the internet anymore. God, I feel so embarrassed. How many hits that thing even have, anyways? Uh, let's see. Oh, crap. What? Has over 200,000 hits. The God dang it! I hate my life! <coughs> Basically, the advice about this is, uh, people, if you're trying to be a superhero, and uh, you're, you need your belt to hold up your pants and something like that, and just, or for any kind of Clothing mishaps. Always, like, I'll, no, not triple truck. Um, what was it? Quartet. I mean, just, I'm, let me just say four times. Check, to four times, check your clothing, make sure you have every, everything. So, yeah. Now, that's my advice. So, yeah. Well, thank you guys for watching this blog. I hope you guys had some, a good time. I hope you guys will enjoy, like the new scenery. And hopefully, we'll have my lamp back soon. And, yeah. Uh, 90% down. It should be almost. Hold down. Hold on. Hey guys, I'm back. Oh God, Hulk, oh, you, you're so fat. The heck? How much do you eat? Yes. Oh, I ate a lot. Uh, uh, he's fat. Like what the? Hulk with Jesus. Yeah. Hulk, what happened? Oh, I kind of ate out the entire her like entire blum special leg, and now I got really fat. And yeah, I feel really sick and woozy. Hulk, why would you have the whole FA? Yeah, you also need. Yeah, I found your tab. Um, about thirty thousand dollars you need to pay. Well, why? Why thirty thousand dollars? Like, I think it'll be at least a hundred dollars, not thirty thousand. Yeah, I kind of broke some stuff there. Ah, oh, jeez, Hulk. Uh, I re I feel really woozy. Oh, Hulk, please don't. I have to come here. It's like oh, we're already at ninety-two percent. Uh oh. What? Uh, he kind of fell on the computer, he's asleep now, and he broke the computer, and when we turn it back on, it means we're going to have to reset the entire process, so you're gonna, the video's going to be up for a while much longer. What the? God dang it!